Next time you drive across the new Mario Cuomo Bridge, the Steel Hulk adjacent to it will be gone. That eastern span of the Tappan Zee Bridge is on its last legs and will be demolished with explosives this morning. Communities near the bridge are bracing for impact. Traffic impact, that is. Oh, I'm a little concerned about the traffic. Prepare for delays beginning at 10 a.m. for about an hour when state police stop traffic on the throughway between exits 9 and 11. Police in Tarrytown and Nyack will have extra officers on hand to direct local traffic, but warn drivers to find alternate routes. I just was surprised because it's like a work day. A lot of people travel. The work was originally scheduled for Saturday, but had to be postponed due to high winds. The spokesperson from the Thruway Authority says Tuesday was the way to go, since traffic at 10 a.m. is typically lighter than the rest of the week. Plus, stats for the upcoming holiday weekend show volume would be higher. Another factor, snow in the forecast. Demolition experts will be using explosives to safely lower the 672-foot span. It's expected to take 30 seconds. We're told engineers are placing a steel-type net at the river bottom beneath the bridge so it can be easily removed. Ahead of the bridge coming down, many people were grabbing these posters to put up. We saw more and more people coming in saying, you know, how can I take home a piece of this? Since in just a few hours, the eastern part of the decades-old bridge will be history. Tappan Zee constructors are working with Metro North to have minimal impact to the Hudson line. We're told local residents will not be affected, and once it's safe to do so, the roads will reopen. We're live in Irvington, Westchester County. Jenna DeAngelis, CBS 2 News. All right, Jenna, thanks so much.